All right. That sucked. So, yeah, the Sharks lose 4-3 to three in triple overtime with an epic game. And you're on... I mean, that was a great game to watch, except for a Sharks fan. Oh, that sucked. Um, these types of games, you have trouble trying to breathe. And it was one of those games that sucks. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself. Uh, trying to recap this game with a full uh, straight mind. It's hard to do that when it's late. But anyways, yeah, the first period, the Sharks were outplayed in the first couple periods again, even though they scored twice. I mean, that first was a 10 seconds into the game. They allowed a goal that quickly. I forgot who brain farted, but there was some screw-ups there. Uh, yeah, they tied it up quickly, and then they scored on a, on a power play uh, to even it up. I think it was 2-2 at the uh, break. Uh, really, Martin Jones had to make some big saves that game just to save them. Uh, they really didn't play as well in those f the first 40 minutes. Uh, so then the last 20 minutes, the Sharks were looking pretty competitive. I got a, They looked a lot better than what I thought they would. Uh, so there was that. I was, I was impressed with, uh, really, once again, Martin Jones. Uh, but, yeah, Brett Burns scores on the power play. The Sharks go up and think, okay, let's see how their defense looks. And one nasty turnover from Paul Martin tied the game. Just one stupid turnover. The, that's the one turnover that's going to hurt for a while. Um, you know, six years ago, or sorry, ten years ago in Edmonton, the Sharks lost when Rafi Torres made a hit, and then they lost in triple overtime to a Dwayne Rollison ten years ago. That was some ancient stuff, but they were demoralized after that, and they lost three consecutive games. What happens this time? I don't know. Joe Thornton and Marlowe were on that team, but most of this team was not there. Uh, yeah, the Sharks, very frustrating game as a whole, uh, the overtime. Now, the first overtime, they, they had some chances, and but so did the Preds. They had some chances as well. Uh, I thought I thought the Sharks, that one call, obviously there's that one call that was controversial when the Sharks scored, uh, that one offsides possibly, but actually I saw a tag up, so I didn't see an issue with that one. But the first overtime, that call where they said there was a goaltender interference, I, I didn't see that. I thought he was out of the crease when, when it happened, and... They called it an interference, so the goal happened, doesn't happen when Pavelski looked like he scooped it in. And there was that one play where Couture was skating hard and he was able to create a chance, but they were like playing for a power play. They were hoping they would get a power play, and they didn't get one until late in the second overtime period, uh, in which that looked terrible. Uh, penalty kill was okay. Penalty kill wasn't a problem this game, but uh, they couldn't score five on five in the last. I don't know how many minutes of the game. Uh, they, they were just trying to shove it or trying to pass too much. It's, it's one of those things or one or the other. Uh, there, there were chances, though. There definitely were. And Pekka Rene stood firm. There were some plays where he had to slide across that uh, saved the game. There was that one wraparound that I thought was going to go in, and that, that was frustrating. I, I, didn't, I have not seen the replay of the goal. I kind of shut it off as quick as I saw it. So I, I haven't seen the bounce. But, yeah, that sucked. Uh, Obviously, the Preds even up the series. And I find those game fours the most important of all. So I don't know about this series. I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm nervous. This is a series that I really thought the Sharks were the better team and who knows what. But it, it was a, just a tough game, tough fought game all around for both sides. Uh, Rene and Martin Jones stood pretty firm. And that's all I can say. I mean, Preds have a good penalty kill unit as well. And for the Sharks to score twice, I think it was a miracle. So... Yeah, they go back to San Jose, and we'll see what happens. But I'm not liking what I see after a game like this. This this hurts. This one's going to hurt for a while. Uh, let me know what you all think. It sucks. I'll get over it, but it sucks right now. We'll see you guys later.